cleanup day at the Perez Rodriguez household. And this is the reason I'm looking a hot, but kind of cute mess. <laughs> um, anyway, I almost didn't have a vlog for you guys because anything that was interesting this week, I didn't tape because I'm still a little camera shy outdoors. I don't like people staring at me while I'm doing things, but I had a wonderful Mother's Day weekend with my family and my sister was over. Uh, we went to a festival, an art festival, and it was excellent. And they gave me the nicest gift. These were my Mother's Day present, but I literally buy Tom's every three months, same ones black ones and here's the cool thing about it you purchase Tom's and it will give a pair of new shoes to a child in need one for one love it and we went out for uh, was it lunch or dinner I think it was like a yeah lunch dinner situation <laughs> and um, it was very nice and we had a great time um, talking about life etc which I'm gonna make a blog about that later I'm not a blogger I really want to be so bad I really admire Casey Neistat and everything that he does <sighs> I love it I almost didn't have this blog but I said to myself Tyra what will Casey Neistat do he will blog anyway even when there's nothing interesting he makes the most the smallest things seem interesting I want to get there and if I want to get there I have to practice so today sorry guys I promise I will get better it's going to be about <laughs> me cleaning up um, and just so you know this is what I look like every day sometimes without eyebrows most of the time I have my glasses on that's why I have those marks right there on my nose I'm usually like doing some pre-planning and, and getting things ready for an event or for the channel and I usually have my audible playing in the background with something motivational to keep me motivated or I play Sade or whatever gets my you know my creative juices flowing for sure Alexa play my last book you finished you are a badass every day restarting it this is on um, all right guys let's get started my husband just finished the outside of the house i am going to tackle the kitchen especially the refrigerator gosh things accumulate in that fast um and i'm gonna make a little bit of breakfast for myself because i am starving i haven't had breakfast yet and it is like noon all right guys let's go follow me all right guys let's see what's in my fridge oh i think i may call this video what's in my fridge there you go look at that it is packed with things that don't need to be in here anymore it might not be bad for a lot of people but there's a lot of things that need to go um let's start in this corner we eat lots of eggs, guys, lots of them. We usually have about four to five dozen of eggs and we like Vital Farm. They're brown eggs and they're pasture raised eggs. They're pretty expensive. They're about $6.29 a dozen, but they are so fresh. And once you go there, you can go back. <laughs> I couldn't find something funny to say about that. But yeah, seriously, you cannot have any other types of eggs once you eat those. Um, and yesterday I made mashed potatoes um, and this is what's left over and we are going to eat it again today because <laughs> usually if I cook one day I make sure that I have enough for the next day because I never have time to do anything and that's all I really made yesterday was the potatoes because oh and some broccoli I did have broccoli um, but they had it with um, fried chicken from Publix <laughs> um, I feel bad you know but it was delicious um, I also bought baked they can have a choice of you know rotisserie chicken or fried I ate the fried my husband likes to eat the baked because he's the healthiest of us in the house and yeah and for my mashed potatoes FYI if you care to know I use evaporated milk butter and sea salt and it is delicious uh, there's mayo my husband likes mayo with his sandwiches and uh, ragu sauce that I use for my uh, whatever pasta uh, dishes. Great, my daughter picked the other day, some OJ, and back here, almond chocolate milk uh, for my daughter. We usually only just drink water. 
we don't really drink like soda or anything like that my daughter likes <clears throat> orange juice sometimes and she usually likes the other brand i don't know what she picked tropicana i don't really like tropicana but whatever um we eat lots of avocados as well i eat them a lot with my eggs uh, which i will be making in a little bit this is leftover broccoli from yesterday um and this is leftover uh, lasagna that i made also uh, i made lasagna rolls um, and it's delicious let's open it <laughs> It probably looks not so tasty right now. Yeah, so there it is. I made two dishes of this. So this is what's left over, and I'm probably gonna throw it out because I made this about five days ago, so it needs to go. And here's a piece of the edible, piece of the chocolate left over from an edible arrangement for Mother's Day. Um, yeah, we ate that fruit, but we didn't eat that yet. Um, I think this is my daughter's applesauce. She still likes applesauce. This is like strawberry applesauce. Lettuce, we eat lots of salads. My husband loves um, spinach with his eggs. And here I have some arroz con gandules left over from the other day. See what I say? I have so many leftovers. And they don't eat it, you know? Ugh. So here's some arroz con gandules that I made the other day. That's rice and pigeon peas. And um, I'm still gonna save it. It's still good. <laughs> so I do cook, you know? But I make a lot so it can last for a couple of days. They usually eat the same meal for two days. Oh, that's my fridge saying, close me. Let me close it and open it again. Okay, here we go. These are some leftover wings from Mother's Day for my daughter. Just sit in there. She, I don't know what she brings at home. She never eats it. And here's some juca. Uh, this is a root that, um, I don't know, a lot of Latin people eat this, you know, and I, I make it, I use it for its soup, and I had this leftover from the soup that I made the other day. And these are my um, cupcakes that I keep for prop. They're real cupcakes, they're not prop cupcakes, but they're prop cupcakes, if you know what I mean. I also have some down here. I just keep them around once I use them in case I need to use it for props for, you know, dessert tables and stuff. Not for events, but just for my channel. And turkey bacon. And I love pepper jack cheese. And uh, let's see what else is going on in here. Uh, organic butter and American cheese. Um, nothing interesting guys uh, this is this has been sitting here forever it needs to go uh, some Pepto and this is not what it says it is this is actually Chile homemade Chile from um, when we went to visit Connecticut not too long ago um, someone gave that to my husband um, and almond milk we keep usually three in here uh, of the or um, original almond milk uh, we love it we don't drink regular milk and this is something that they gave away at the festival from McDonald's it's pretty tasty and I have to have hot sauce I love hot sauce I have hot sauce with my eggs and avocados and turkey bacon that's usually my um, breakfast and some Parmesan cheese and you know just some condiments and that's pretty much it for my fridge guys the freezer i'm afraid to show it to you because it's kind of messy i have <laughs> oh no it's not it's not that bad i have more cupcakes um 
and more cupcakes over there. And here are some paletas. These are like, I don't know how you call paletas in English. Just ice cream, I guess. They're from Mexico. I love those. They're mango, coconut, and strawberries. I tear this up all the time when I have a sweet tooth. Okay, paletitas. They're like minis though. They're really small. See, they're really, really, really small. Very tasty. There's only like two left. And we have breasted chickens and we have um, bison. We like bison as well. Um, grass fed. We're into grass fed things. And my daughter loves these beer broths. So they're just sitting there. We like to eat fresh a lot too. So we don't buy a lot of frozen food. Only what we're going to eat for the week and stuff like that. What's in here? Got some onions and this is this has been sitting there forever. I gotta throw this out. I was gonna bake something and never did. And broccoli. We eat lots of broccoli. What is this? Green pepper that's like rotten in there. Look at that. Nice and soft. Disgusting. Alright. So now I'm just going to throw away what needs to be thrown away, guys. that's it it wasn't that bad I usually try to keep it up but I just had to throw away some of this food had to My daily breakfast this is literally what I eat every single day <laughs> but on the couch I eat my breakfast right there because <laughs> I'm usually working editing or doing something that's what I did I eat it on the couch all right guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video I will be better the next time I promise make sure to submit um, your my Tyra Perez projects. I'm going to announce the winner July 1st, so you have until the day before to apply and submit your photos. All right, guys, I love you. Until next time, bye. One day. Well, at least the rocks are picked up. Yeah, I'll blow it out. Throwing away my cake over there. Uh, are you? Yeah, because it's just getting all wobbly and stuff. It's a hot mess now, so I'll forget it. I think I'll smash it down the trash. Yeah, so no worries. You tired? That was a lot of work. I'm sure.